Welcome to Research World. In this lecture, we will discuss the difference between descriptive statistics and inferential statistics. Before starting the difference between descriptive and inferential statistics, one must know what is meant by statistics. Statistics is a branch of mathematics dealing with the collection, analysis, interpretation, and presentation of numerical data. There are two types of statistics, descriptive statistics, inferential statistics. Descriptive statistics is a branch of statistics that is concerned with describing the characteristics or features of the given data only. Descriptive statistics is a term given to the analysis of data that helps to describe, show and summarize data in a meaningful way. In simple words, its function is to describe our data. Example of descriptive statistics. Assume we want to describe the test scores in a particular class of 50 students. We record all of the test scores and calculate the summary statistics and produce graphs. These results indicate that the mean score of this class is 75.22. Common tools of descriptive statistics, descriptive statistics, provide summaries about the data in the form of mean, median mode, range, variance, standard deviation, etc. Inferential statistics is used examine the relationships between variables within a sample and then make generalizations or predictions about how those variables will relate to a larger population. Inferential statistics is a way of making inferences about populations based on samples. For instance, you could use inferential statistics to assess whether there is a significant difference in the academic performance of urban and rural schools. We are making generalization in this example by studying relationship between variables. Regression, correlation, hypothesis testing, confidence intervals, analysis, analysis of variance, ANOVA and chi-square tests are examples of inferential statistics. Descriptive statistics is concerned with describing the population under study. Inferential statistics is concerned with drawing conclusions or making generalization about the population. Describe, organize, analyze, and presentation of data comparison, testing, and predicting data. It can be achieved with the help of charts, graphs, tables, etc. It can be achieved by probability. Mean, median, mode, standard deviation, etc. Regression, ANOVA, hypothesis testing. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and press bell icon for upcoming videos.